who had one referee uh, a rapid charge contest in between but really it was who lost in the semi-final against the japanese arai uh, he went straight to the bronze medal contest yeah, it's a good atmosphere here in the tokyo metropolitan gymnasium and we're looking forward to have all of the bronze medal contests we are on mat number two. Kotsoyev is the number two in the world after Sulaymanitsa of Georgia. Seated here, as I said, as number one. Hey. Two bronze medals at World Championships he collected this year and last year. And his opponent, Pirelli, He can again come up onto the podium. Last year, he won this tournament. What a big success that was. And today, he got a chance again at least to get onto the podium. And if you have a look at the head-to-head, -head, we saw this in the graphics. Two to nil. Two times. Kutsoyev won that. That uh, that contest. First one was last year, the Masters in Jerusalem. And the second time the Asari fighter won was this year at the Tel Aviv Grand Slam. So looking there for a grip, cross grip, Kutsoyev. He knows he has to attack hey. with that grip. If he's not including the head, you need to come up with an attack. And he did, but not successful, not yet. Change to the other side. Kostoyev. But that is, that's just not enough. So the referee wants to see a little bit more. Both received a penalty for avoiding the grip. And this is just defensive. So after contest is gone, no score yet. Both with a penalty. Cross grip again. And looking there for the uh, Sumigaeshi. No, no, it's not no, up to um, Pirelli to come up with an attack. A few we have seen from Kotsoyev. Block that one. She, this time he can turn him and he gets the score for it. And he also got the chance there to finish that one off on the ground. Ten seconds needed for the second Vasari. Already received one for a throw. That's it. But so yeah, we're going to see on the podium under 100 kilo, under 100 kilos on a bronze medal. Go for bronze medal.